Hey, it's uh, Exploring Northwest Myanmar once again. The reason I've got all my gear on my back instead of on the motorbike is because we're going to try to bring the motorbike to the other side of the Irrawaddy, which means it has to go on a boat. I thought best it be unencumbered when it does so. Find someone here who speaks English. It's not going to be easy. Oh, it's not very big. Bring it about. Do you know? Motorcycle? Motorcycle? I get it. Over there. Oh. Okay. Okay. Last time I crossed the river, it cost 10,000. This time it's costing 800. What's the difference? Hands to plow seeds, the soul love is not a concept. When you see that garden grow, won't be too hard to find rest. Hands to plow seeds, the soul love is not a concept. When you see that garden grow, won't be too hard to find a rest. You got a long way to go. And it's a long road behind. Well, it's a long way to go. We're gonna meet you up ahead. gotten directions from a local, we go that way, and so here we go, on the way to Chongwa. The village of Noeni. Noeni. Noeni, yes. <laughs> okay. I suppose you can kind of tell from the video that was that road. It's one of those roads where the asphalt has worn away, leaving the rocks from the you know the base of the road underneath. So you can't drive on the road, nothing but rocks. But the shoulders are okay, so you can put along 35 kilometers per hour. Oh, I've made it to Takaung. Takaung is a little town. Hopefully there's a place to stay here, I'm not sure. But it's the site of a very important ancient historical archaeological site. And they have right here the Archaeological Museum of Takaung, which we're going to look at. The city of Tagong is up on the 
hill bit on the Aramadi River. Now, how old is the city? Well, there are some who think that it's up to 3,000 years ago that people were living here and left these ancient remains. 3,000 years ago would make it the oldest city in Myanmar. So it's, it's a bit controversial. They're basing it upon some records found in India that describe this city and where it was located. But these records, said the city was 3,000 years old, said it was on the western bank of the Irrawaddy, not the eastern bank. Mm -hmm. Because it's on a hill, it's very possible. In fact, you can see or go around that way that the way rivers meander and oxbow and such that this hill could or the river could have been on the other side of the hill in the past. See, it used to be on the other side. It used to be the path of the Irawaddy. Interesting. An interesting museum. Well, I enjoyed it. And uh, best of all, I asked the attendants, is there a guest house in this town, a hotel? Because I've come here and I'm going to stay here. And it, there's nothing, there's nothing on the map or any indication there's any kind of accommodation. And, you know, it's a city of 10,000 people, so who knows? But there is one! Yay! The Myat Thane Soap. Let's go find it. Okay, there's a reason why this nice new hotel doesn't have a sign or anything yet. Because it's not finished yet. They don't have electricity. It's still being built. But there's another place. Okay. First and then... Shower. No western style toilet. Okay. Technically, I should not be allowed to stay here. Fortunately, the hotel is run by children. So, we're okay. <laughs> Here's a bop. Aha! The remains of an ancient city walls. Silence is welcome. There are stories in the ground, we'll join them in the autumn. Seasons come, seasons go, silence is welcome. There are stories in the ground, we'll join them in the autumn. Seasons come, seasons go, silence is welcome. There are stories in the ground, we'll join them in the autumn. It's gotta be. This has got to be the weirdest guest house I've ever been in. I mean, as you saw earlier, my the person who checked me in was an 11-year-old boy. And there's like no one around. There's no adults. It's like an episode of Star Trek where all the, old, the adult hostel staff, staff was killed and only the children remained to run the hotel. Well, I just need some basic things like a frickin' towel and there's nobody around. But what is nice is that I know that I'm in a very, very old place. Not more than 500 meters that way is like where the palace was 2,000 years ago. And so, you know, like while Julius Caesar was roaming the earth, right here in this very spot, there could have been a guest house and someone was complaining about lack of towels. And I'm doing the same some 60 generations later. It's back to those old words of wisdom. Don't forget to bring a towel. If I can only get high. <laughs>